are heading back to our coffee shop this morning for our coffee club. I love this. Kim DiGiulio live in a spot that I think she's going to be staying for a few more hours because <laughs> she, she is making friends left and right out this there. This is a great space. <laughs> Making friends, getting energized. I mean, what more could you want for your morning? And guys, I'm so excited because we have a repeat coffee club member, Vicki, behind me. I'm going to put you on the spot. Come here, Vicki. So Vicki joined us a few, it was like two in months November. ago, back in November. And uh, she came, she saw us this morning mm -hmm. and you came here. Yes. So. And is this your first time here? This is my first time here. It was my first time the last time too. So this is great. I'm so excited. <laughs> Smells fantastic. You're just learning about all the coffee yeah. shops here in Dearborn. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, so what did you order? I ordered the Haraz Latte. And then, um, spoiler alert, my assistants, I'm bringing you a pour over coffee and um, a hot chocolate. And you know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is so nice. So Vicki, thank you so much for Absolutely. being a repeat coffee yeah, club member. I love it. And here's a little bit about the Haraz Coffee House here in downtown Dearborn. Haraz Coffee House in Michigan Avenue in downtown East Dearborn is a go-to spot for a cup of coffee all day and night. We're trying to bring it back to the standards where families can come in and have, you know, coffee together. You know, uh, people at work can come here and have meetings. Owner and CEO Hamza Nasser says late night coffee is an Arabic tradition that he'd like to see catch on. That's why this place is open until 11 p.m., where people can enjoy coffee just like it's done in Yemen. Our most popular drink is the Haraz latte and the Harazi coffee, which is the coffee with cream Yemeni style. Making coffee wasn't something Hamas grew up doing, but it's part of his culture and he wanted to pass it on to the people here in Dearborn. I've never ever worked in a coffee shop in my life. That's one thing my friends were all like, what the heck are you doing? Why are you opening a coffee shop if you don't have any experience? I'm like, trust me, I have experience at home. I got a whole coffee bar and I think I can do this. He's not only giving his customers the experience and taste of coffee that can be found in Yemen, but he's also training young baristas as well. We have the Haraz uh, Barista Academy just down the street to teach young entrepreneurs and those who have a passion for coffee. Teaching them the traditions of Yemeni coffee. That was the first method coffee was ever made. And here at Haraz, is, we use that same method that's over 1,700 years old. It's an amazing method to think how old that method is and teaching people about that is owner Hamza Nasser. Thanks for joining us this morning, Hamza. You're welcome. Uh, so tell me, I mean, you didn't even know much about, I mean, you knew coffee, but it wasn't part of your industry at all. And now you're teaching people how to do it. You're serving it here in Dearborn. I mean, how does one get involved in, in uh, this, the school? So you can easily register online at harazcoffeehouse.com and choose the date and time you okay. want to, and we'll, you know, you'll come in for the course. I, I just love this passion for coffee. And we're certainly happy that you decided during the pandemic to, to build this place because you, know you knew one day we'd all want to meet again. Yeah, it was, I mean, it was every, every single moment was worth it. It was stressful in the beginning, but I mean, the outcome is always greater. Yes, and speaking of the outcome, let's try some coffee. So what do we have here? So over here we have the Saudi style uh, coffee. It is boiled for a minimum of 20 minutes and it comes with a, a saffron flavor. Okay. Give it, a, give it a little whirl. Oh, so clumsy. Oh, that's so light. Yeah. It's like unlike any other coffee you've ever tried before. Yep, it is. It does have a unique style and that's the famous uh, Bedouin uh, style of coffee. And then over here we have the so if, so if you're a chai person, you know, there, we have chai options. And this is the Adani chai, which is the one of the most top, you the know, popular. popular drinks in Haraz. And so th these little trays, this is what maybe people would come at night to get after a meal or something like that. And, you know, this right here is more than just coffee where we give you a whole experience over here. That's got like a really nice sweetness yeah. to it. Yeah. I love this. Cardamom. This is balanced. Everything's balanced, cardamom, uh, tea, all of that, so. This is really good. Okay, well, I really need to <laughs> watch my caffeine intake, uh, but thank you so much for making thank this for me. Uh, Haraz Coffee House here in Dearborn, Michigan Avenue, right at, near the corner of Schaefer. Come on by, Coffee Club is here, but come whenever you can because this place is really extraordinary.